What's up, everybody? Uh, so, you read the title, you know the news. And, uh, I'm making it, I didn't plan on making this video, actually. I, I didn't want to jump on a train, I didn't want to... You know, didn't want to seem like I'm chasing clicks. But the minute I heard of this news, which was this morning before I was about to take another nap or something. <sighs> this is a rough one. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, I'm trying not to be too sad because I never knew the guy, never grew up with him. I'm sure there's people who have a right to be sad, and I'm one of those guys that if... I didn't have a real personal connection with you like that. I don't want to assume feelings that are, you know, fake, I guess. But I had been following his career for a, a very long time. I mean, I didn't see Thurgood Marshall, still need to see that. And I also still need to see 21 Bridges. But yeah, ever since I learned that he was one of the running mates to be Black Panther, I started following his career, I started watching uh, some of his movies and seeing some of his interviews and I was a big fan of the dude. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm, I was in this YouTube game to hopefully, you know, I'm, I mean, I knew it was a lofty dream and all of that stuff, but I was like, you know, dude's, dude's young, he's like 40 something, he looks 28, maybe I have a chance. But hey, yeah, it's sad news, man. It it sucks. It it sucks. It sucks. I mean, you know, that whole Black Panther crew. Like, I'm I'm from South Africa. I know I sound like this, but I'm from South Africa. So yeah, you know, if you check my locale, check my background. I'm from South Africa, and we we had our first Comic Con. Our first Comic Con, and I definitely attribute that to the Black Panther movie, and to what Chadwick Boseman did with the character. I definitely attribute that. That's a huge impact, and that's had ripple effects for days, and it's highlighted people who were never highlighted before. That was the power of that movie, and Chadwick Boseman as a character and as an actor. This sucks, man. <laughs> And 43, 43, that's, that's way to take care of your health. Like, it's important. Take, take care of your health. I didn't expect to wake up to this. And, you know, my condolences to the family, of course. They're the ones getting it the hardest. Yeah, we gotta remember with these celebrities that we we are just fans, you know, I'm just a fan, you know, I didn't get to know him, you know, on that level, like that, so I, I don't want to insult the family by bawling my eyes out or anything, that's, that's, that's not right to me personally, but, man, this feels like when Stan Lee went. You know? Like... 2020, you piece of shit. Literally. Like... We needed a Chadwick in the world. I'm sure there's more, but we needed him. And, uh, yeah, man. It's not cool. It's not cool. I don't even want to do any, like, what kind of, I see a lot of people doing the what kind of salutes, uh, I don't know. I just want to say rest, rest in power, man. Rest in paradise. Hope heaven's everything that it's, uh, cracked up to be. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you all in a... Another video, hopefully a happier uh, video. But pay pay your respects. 
uh, and actually, one thing I want to say, one thing I want to say, actually, yeah, for you meme culture people, for you meme culture people, because I've been a part of meme culture myself, but not to that degree where I make fun of uh, everything, especially when I don't know all the details. I just want to say, l learn to know the details. Don't. The memes that were coming out, it, it pissed me off because I was just like, we don't know what's going on, and all of y'all are making these hectic jokes. Maybe we, and I didn't want to believe that the dude was unhealthy. I thought maybe it was a roll or something. Because he, he looks so fit and in shape and healthy. I mean, prior to prior to Black Panther, I mean Black Panther, he bulked up, sure. But if you see him in, if you see him in the in the James Brown biopic, he's he, he was he he was healthy. So yeah, meme culture, internet culture. Can we learn to relax? Like, you know, can we remember that this is the internet? It's not real life. Okay? It's a tool to be used, but it's not real life. There's like people going through real life out there that's not on camera. That's not in an SEO search engine. And before we make all the jokes, can we at least try and get all the information? I mean, I'm probably speaking into the ether here, you know. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Yeah, I was trying to close out this video, but I guess I just had to talk on that. Um, Alright. Again, rest in power, rest in paradise, Chadwick Boseman. Thank you for what you did and what you're going to continue to do even though you're not here because you're going to inspire a lot of us, a lot of us, a lot of us here in, in South Africa and Africa and across the world. Twenty twenty, you piece of shit. Anyway. I'll uh, see you all in another video because my stir man gotta be out. Peace.